Hi everyone, welcome to another video on CompTIA Network Plus exam question and answer series. In today's video, we will study the Ethernet standards. So, without further ado, let's get started. So, the question number one in today's video is that what are the characteristic features of the 10 base T Ethernet standard? And we have to select three answers, and the correct answers and options are. The transfer rate of 10 megabits per second over two pair of category 3 or better UTP cable. So the 10 base T has a transfer rates of 10 megabits per second over two pair of cat 3 or better UTP cable. The next correct option is that it has the maximum cable segment length of 100 meters. And the last correct option is that this standard uses RJ. 45 connector. So these are the correct options that relates to the 10 base T Ethernet standard. It has a 10 megabit per second speed. It has a maximum length of 10 uh, of 100 meters and the standard uses the RJ45 connector. Question number two is that what are the characteristic features of 100 base TX Ethernet standard and we have again to select three correct options. So the first correct option is that this standard has a maximum segment length of 100 meter. The next correct option is that this standard has a transfer rate of 100 megabit per second over two pair of CAT5 or better cable. And the next correct option is that the twisted pair copper cabling CAT5 or a higher cat category cable is used. So this base, the 100 base TX Ethernet standard, it has a maximum segment length of 100 meter. It has a transfer data rate of 100 Mbps or two pair of CAT5 or better cable. And this standard uses twisted pair copper cabling. Question number three is that what are the characteristic features of 1000 base T Ethernet standard? And again, we have to select three answers. So let's get straight to the correct options. And the option number one is, the correct option number one is that it has a maximum cable segment length of 100 meters. The second correct option is that again, it uses the twisted pair copper cabling that is CAT5 or higher cabling and the last correct option is that it uses all four pair of wires in a cable for data transmission. Question number four is that what are the characteristic features of 100 base FX Ethernet standard and again we have to select three answers and the correct options are that 100 base FX is an Ethernet standard that has a maximum cable segment length of up to 412 meter that is for half duplex communication and since this is FX so this is a fiber optic communication and it is multi-mode fiber standard and the last correct option is that maximum cable length of up to 2 kilometer when full duplex communication is used. So 100 base FX Ethernet standard has a maximum cable length of 412 meter when used in half duplex communication. It is a multi-mode fiber Ethernet uh, standard and it has a maximum cable segment length of 2 kilometer when used in full duplex communication. Question number five is that what which of the following answer refers to the 100 base SX standard and again we have to select three answers and the correct options are again this uh, standard uses LED as the source of light this means that it is optical fiber standard and the next correct option is that it is multi-mode fiber standard and the last correct option is that maximum cable length is of up to 300 meter. So the uh, correct option for 100 base SX are again 
it is it uses led as a source of light this is a multi mode fiber standard and maximum cable segment length is of up to 300 meter question number 6 is that what are the characteristic features of 1000 base sx ethernet standard and we have to select two correct options and the correct options are that the maximum cable segment length is between 220 and 550 meters and this is a multi mode fiber optic cabling so these are the correct options for 1000 base sx ethernet standard so question number 7 is that which of the answer listed below refer to the 1000 base lx ethernet standard and we have to select three correct options and the correct options are the first correct option is that the maximum cable length is up to 5 km over single mode fiber so when the distance is more than a km then obviously the uh, ofc mode is single mode because in the multi mode fiber we have a distance of up to few hundred meters it is less than a km the second correct option is that again it is understood that it is fiber optic cabling and the last correct option is that maximum cable length is up to 550 meter when used over multi mode fiber so in single mode it has a 5 km uh, segment length while in multi mode it has a length of 550 meter question number 8 is that which of the following answer refers to 10g or 10 gigabit per second base sr ethernet standard and again we have to select three correct options and the correct options are that this standard uses laser as the source of light and this is the multi mode fiber standard and the maximum cable segment length is up to 400 meter question number 9 is that what are the characteristic feature of 10g base lr ethernet standard and we have again to select three correct answers and the correct answer are that it uses laser as the source of light and it is the single mode fiber and the maximum cable segment length is up to 10 km so the 10g base lr and sr these are two standard sr and lr so the lr is for single mode and it has a maximum length of 10 km you can relate this uh, or remember by using the trick that lr stands for long range it doesn't necessarily stand for this but you can remember it as such and the sr stands for short range and so the sr standard is for multi mode fiber and its mm, segment is up to 500 or 400 meters and lr is for single mode with a distance or segment length of up to 10 km So that's all for today I hope you have learned something from today video if you haven't subscribed yet so please subscribe and stay tuned for the next video on this topic thank you all